you're yet to play through the Western Epic that is Red Dead Redemption 2, consider blocking the updates from your original disc install. According to reports from multiple gamers and dedicated Red Dead Redemption communities, Rockstar seemingly removed ambient occlusion in a visual downgrade, though that was not disclosed in the most recent patch notes, if true. The news originally came from Twitter user Dereal Bandicoot, who shared side-by-side -side screenshots of version 1.00 and version 1.06 of the Western game, version 1.06 being the latest update that was released earlier this month. There's a good chance you're going to need to blow these images up to notice the difference, especially if you're a newcomer to ambient occlusion. Put simply, ambient occlusion is a game rendering realistic lighting based on the actual geometry of the room. If a lighting source would be blocked, we wouldn't expect to see every inch of nooks and crannies. For a visual demonstration, check out this image courtesy of website Gaming Scan. You can notice on the right image that shadows are more prevalent, dark colors are more rich, and everything looks more realistic. That is the image with ambient occlusion where light source is being blocked. Now you could do that same comparison with the two photos. The one on the left is update 1.00 with ambient occlusion, and the one on the right is 1.06 without ambient occlusion. Several things pop up in the comparison photo. You can see that Arthur's jacket is more illuminated and has far less shadow on the rightmost image taken with update 1.06. Shadows under the bar are less prevalent and the general lighting is all around brighter. To spot the differences easier, go back and forth between these two images like this. Oddly enough, it doesn't appear that the latest update mentions anything about removing or altering the lighting of the game, let alone a full removal of ambient occlusion. In fact, lighting isn't mentioned at all outside of small changes and texture issues. Obviously, there's the chance that there are mitigating factors causing these differences. In previous rumors of downgrades for, let's say, Infamous or Spider-Man, these could have been caused by differences in the weather or time of day. On the other hand, it isn't totally uncommon to see assets shift in updates as games are further optimized, either intentionally or unintentionally. However, if this is real and not just an unfortunate side-by-side -side screenshot grab, it is a shame. One of the principal reasons the game received a 10 from DualShockers is because it was a technical showstopper, and that includes the lighting. Of course, to enjoy the game as it was originally deployed, you'd simply just need to uninstall the game and reinstall it without the internet connection and without the patches. Red Dead Redemption 2 is available now on PS4 and Xbox One. For more information and news on Red Dead Redemption 2, visit DualShockers and hit the subscribe button below.